The Babajide Songulu, the governor of Lagos State, has approved a 33% increment of all state pensioners under the Defined Benefits Scheme, Pay As You Go, with effect from January 1, 2020. The governor approved the payment of a balance of 25% allowance for officers on grade level 7 and above who had retired between May 2000 and August 2004. Ajibola Bonle, the Commissioner for Establishments, Training and Pensions, disclosed this on Tuesday during a meeting with members of the Nigerian Union of pensioners in Lagos. She affirmed that the increment and payment of the arrears will take effect from September 2020 in a bid to meet up with the harmonization exercise for the pensioners. She said despite the shortfall of revenue owing to the COVID-19 pandemic, Lagos state government has regularly paid a total sum of 1.893 billion naira to pensioners under the defined benefit scheme. According to her, under the contributory pension scheme, the Lagos state government paid over 21 billion naira as accrued pensions rights to 5,000 354 retirees from May 2019 to August 2020, while over 978 million naira was credited into the retirement savings joint account of 405 retirees in June 2020. And joining us live is Benga Omotashaw, the Commissioner for Information and Strategy, Lagos State. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you so much. Uh, quickly tell us what the harmonization exercise for pensioners is all about. Well, it's uh, people who were being called, uh, and then the governor said, thought that uh, in the, as a matter of responsibility and uh, in the spirit of uh, the times, that we have to reduce the suffering of uh, people and that these people should be paid, and that's exactly what has happened. Okay, and you know, good thing you just mentioned it. I, I, I believe this is good news for pensioners from Lagos State. How would you say the government has also been able to meet up with this, you know, um, bills, even with the, of course, uh, pandemic and the economic crisis across the world, as it seems? I didn't hear that question well. Uh, I'm asking, well, I said, first of all, I believe this is good news for pensioners in Lagos State. I'm asking sure. how the Lagos State government has been able to meet up with these figures even while we're dealing with a pandemic and economic crisis across the world. Well, we, 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 we have uh, a governor that is uh, very creative. In five days, who is a financial expert. He's uh, been in the private sector, in the banking sector before. And then uh, we have uh, able lieutenants in the uh, mold of uh, people who really know what they are doing concerning finances, the Commissioner for Budget and Economic Planning, the Commissioner for Establishment and Pensions and Training. So they all came together with the cabinet and then uh, got a creative way of uh, saving money, even amid the pandemic, and then uh, paying our senior citizens so that uh, it can be well with that. Oh, and is this a one-time move, or is it likely that more pensioners will be accommodated uh, in these in increments and payments? Well, the, we are looking at the books, and then uh, looking at everything. Anybody who is supposed to be paid, anything in Lagos will be paid. It's just a question of time. And I, I believe we are not winning any pension. Those who are supposed to be paid, that have not been paid, they will surely be paid because there is an arrangement. But since uh, Mr. Bades all came on board, he's been paying one point uh, something billion every month so, so that uh, to offset all the arrears. Mm. Oh, that's pretty, pretty interesting. And can you also quickly share with us the state of welfare of uh, pensioners in Lagos State before now? Um, you know, is this a miracle for them? Well, I wouldn't say that uh, maybe before now there are problems or not, but all I know is that uh, since they have been paid, they've been very, very happy, and they've been praising the government, the unionists are happy. And then uh, IP pensioners, Lagos State pensioners are doing well, uh, and they are, they are doing well compared with their counterparts uh, elsewhere. All right, and, and, and uh, hopefully, um, I think you can also quickly speak on this before we go. Uh, will this have any effect or issues with the 2020 budget for Lagos State? No, it's not going to have any problem with the budget because everything has been provided for. Money has been set aside to do things. We are just working and being creative to get the money and then uh, pay them. So it's not going to have any effect on the budget in any way. All right. Thank you so much, uh, Mr. Gbenga Motosha, for sharing with us and uh, looking Thank forward you. to speaking with you again. Thank you.